you say, as you say. So I as will go say. through the presentation also. Please, please, please. Thank you. Thank you. I'm sharing my screen. Yeah, please, please, yeah. please. Yeah, so this is about how to overcome past setbacks and achieve significance, as you can see. Yes. The thing. Let me also uh, open in YouTube so that uh, people who might be there, they can. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So me. right now you are in stay in your house in Delhi, correct? Yes, yes. Right. So I have set up uh, a kind of uh, no home studio. <laughs> right, right. This is my workstation also. Okay, okay. And uh, from here I operate. So many okay. Which part of Delhi you are in actually staying? This is Moir Bihar, East. Okay. okay. East. Yeah, you told me. You, you told me in the messenger. Moir Bihar. Yeah. Yeah. Actually, if somebody looks at you now, they yeah. will not tell that you have worked from morning 8.45 to 7.30 <laughs> and you're sitting. Nobody will tell that. Yes, yes. I, I love this work. I love my work. Actually. I'm lucky in that way that uh, all through my life, I have worked in whatever I love. You know? Under, under just, just by chance that... Uh, my husband didn't allow me to grow in uh, in my previous jobs, you know. Otherwise, I can, I, I can understand. I can understand. I would have. I was interested in data analysis. That is what I was. So you know, data analysis that field requires a lot of training all the time. And right. Just didn't understand that uh, I needed some training. If I right. invest from my own pocket, then it will be huge in the office. Right. Investing that it is nothing. Just I have to invest my time. He didn't understand that, and uh, I don't know. Your your ambition levels were totally different. Well, but like, your ambition level was at ninety, and his ambition level was at thirty. So that was not matching actually. Honestly, I mean, huh? So he was a person actually of huge talent. You know, he was the assistant director in uh, uh, Shahrukh Khan's uh, initial series, Fauji and oh. Karnan. Okay, and okay. He worked with the very famous uh, actors like uh, Nandita Das and all. Right. So a person of that caliber. And he was at Delhi. He was a student in JNU. And okay. uh, you, you can't understand, no? you can't justify, can't understand at all as to why he had become like that. Anyway. Correct, correct. So let us go through this. So in uh, initially, I was actually uh, only addressing people who were mid career professionals, you know. Right, right. Mid professionals who are uh, between 30 to 45 years of age, or right. they had 5 to 12 years of experience. So right. what is happening is nowadays uh, people get very early into jobs now. Uh, by right. the time they are 23, they are into jobs. So right. by the time they are 30, they are already 6-7 years of experience. So exactly. that is why I kept that uh, open. Uh, whoever right. has 5 to 12 years of experience, they are bound to have this kind of trouble. Right. So, but that was actually broadening my audience. And mm. the uh, trick is to narrow down your audience. 
right. in, all, in online space. You know, you have to be a very narrow audience you should start with. Right. Afterwards, people can be of anything. So that was a mistake I was uh, having. And also, okay. I was not talking about my personal issues into this. I was okay. thinking that uh, the part of the other thing, you know, how I grew as a professional, that part I was talking. But I was never, I was not talking about my personal issues, which I talked, I spoke to you today. Right. This, right. this is just 15 days back, uh, my mentors uh, gave me this insight. That you were you were not talking about your lowest low, right. Uh, right? So you need to talk that. So that is why I have changed this uh, to past sales advice. Good, good. Yes. Otherwise, I was talking about productivity only. Right? right, right, right. That's what you told me on the WhatsApp. Productivity, correct? Yeah. So uh, in any case, they have to uh, focus on productivity to get over their trauma. Otherwise, right. the focus will not come. And exactly. it means you have to fully into your job, whatever task you are doing. And uh, because I had the uh, <laughs> fortune of working in wherever I wanted to work, right. it might not have happened to other people. People might not be loving their job. But Correct. I um, also teach them how to love your job. Because okay. when, even if I am working in a job which I love, still there are aspects of the job which I don't like. Exactly. But still I do because that is required, you know, to 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 do what you love. So hundred exactly. percent other things to you do, as you are saying, you no, know, they maybe you are you don't like seventy percent of whatever you are doing, but right. if you like the thirty percent of you, in a enjoy, day, day enjoy. Job, Enjoy. You have to have, love these less seventy percent. Enjoy that, correct? So, as I said, my gratitude to you. Uh, yeah. It will take ninety minutes uh, for this entire thing to complete. Yeah. This is what I tell Ravi. That is why it is there. And don't yeah. take uh, digital notes. Save right. questions to the end so that there will be correct. no correct. break of flow. And Correct. thank you for your patience because it will take 90 minutes. Right, right. And, uh, and uh, if you have something else to do uh, in uh, in between, if you have to go, then right. please right. go. That is what I right. need to see. Correct. 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 I promise you of the best value to the best of, best of my ability so that you can justify your time. And exactly. uh, of course, your time will be well spent. Exactly. Thank you again. And who do I target? Right. I am not targeting those people who are inside their comfort zone. Exactly. Targeting people who have felt this blazing fire inside them. Right. And because of this, when they find this kind of problems in their setbacks, challenges in their life, and because of which they might also have relationship issues. With the boss, with the family, with uh, friends, in the society, anywhere. And yes. somebody would have told them something which is not them. Exactly. And they, they, they have become a rebel. And right. because of that anger, that is a grief, there is a grievance. They are blazing further. Right. And that is indicative of their potential. Because they know inside they are not a limited self. They know they can do much more. I am targeting those people. Right. So how do I know that? I know because of my story, as I told. Correct. Recognized, ignored, overworked, but not given the deal, and it hurts. Willing to take risk. I'm still willing to take risk. Can work harder if you give me a better responsibility, better charge. Whatever challenge, provided there is a reward. Without this reward, so I I will go on doing and doing, but I will not know whether I'm doing okay or useful or anything. So that right. is that is the that is a that is an experience all throughout. Even yesterday, today morning also I spoke to somebody. I told them my topic, my tool, 
resourceful influencing ha has now figured in the first page when you google no that is a huge achievement people struggle for like, even two months back i was looking at my google page resourceful influencing is my tool it was in the 50th page so i was thinking kab aayega ye pehle page mein and suddenly yesterday day before yesterday i tried and it was in the first page you right. you can imagine how happy i was yeah, but yeah. but when i speak about this to people they cannot figure out what i am talking about so right. i i realize that faltu logon ke beech aa gaya you have to move on so one needs to do something for that if you are angry at this position at this point you will not move the universe will not allow you to get from here because with this anger this negativity you will carry this negativity to another place a better place if you are negative if you don't appreciate yourself you cannot respect the res uh, appreciation of others also True. so uh, that is why and not motivated what now maybe another reason so um uh, why we get into that kind of loop why because we think and most of us think that success is a uh, straight line upward it is not we get into if we have potential we normally get into frequent failures because yes. potential always will push you to do something new something very different it is it is a characteristic of high potential people and that makes them fail 90% of the time which means what they will go back in in the spiral and takes a move some few feet backwards and then again they push forward and come and this will happen multiple times in their life and this is a graph by ceo lindy it is it is uh, it is his observation he is looking at working professional lindy mostly have working professional and how they progress forward so this is his observation that it is never a straight line it has to be in loops and there is nothing to be assumed about this values so no so and suddenly at one point when you realize that these are part of your life because you are different because you are trying to do something very different you are not usually conforming to other people so that is why these values are inevitable even after boss nahi samjha aapko that also is a failure he will not give you a promotion aap stuck ho jaoge he will have thousand of complaints bahut negativity ho jayega but again that is part of your package yeah so, yeah, yeah so that is how uh, but we need to realize this to start with we need to realize this so ho sakta hai maybe you were laid off because of this because you didn't understand ho sakta hai what is the reason which has made you stuck socho something you you are holding yourself accountable maybe and this may be affecting your productivity maybe you are giving a chance for others to criticize you dusra kaise criticize karega if you are not giving a chance but it takes a lot of time to realize ki we are giving only the opportunity to them to criticize to koi bhi kisi ko kar sakta hai na आप रास्ते में चलोगे somebody will tell you something. आपको अच्छा नहीं लगे बट हाउ कैन यू हेल्प दैट लोग तो बोलेंगे एंड दैट एंड मेक्स यू लुक फॉर एन अदर जॉब मे बी इफ यू आर इन ए जॉब देन ये सारा चीज जब हो रहा है यू आर थिंकिंग कि हम दूसरे जॉब में चले जाएंगे तो ये सब नहीं होगा इट इज आई भी होगा आई हैव चेंज सो मेनी जॉब थिंकिंग दैट द नेक्स्ट जॉब विल बी बेटर thinking ki uh, chote organization mein chale jayenge to i will be into a senior position yes you will become but the scenario will not change so when this doesn't change what happens industry data says that when you are in in a complaining mode you actually act at 20% productivity level 
or the more senior you are, the more delay it will happen to get another opportunity. Barasal ka experience hai, so you will take three to five years of time to get another suitable opportunity, alternative. So during that three to five years, you will be acting at 20% or less productivity level. What happens to your potential? It becomes a habit to work at that productivity level. Once it becomes a habit, your potential is gone. So here, whenever you are getting a better job, you know ki you can do, but you haven't applied yourself all this time. 20% productivity level, pe kya apply kya what application you uh, would have done? So negative, negative, rahe ke, you have ruined your own potential. So, and when that happens, lot of problem happens which are beyond workplace. You, you blame your workplace, but it is not directly the workplace. Workplace, of course, get, gets affected. And uh, this market research towards the right side, you say, whenever I spoke to somebody, I wrote down what problem he had. And I have listed them out in this slide. The okay. left side is the professional uh, reasons why people are stuck. Right side is the personal, personal reasons why side. people are stuck. Personal. Okay. Now, okay. You, from the numbers, here numbers, you can see that personal numbers affecting your productivity is... More. More. This is what my market research has been. And so, now, what happens? It has affected your life decisions, your confidence level, learning a new skill, name work, consistency is gone. Uh, big vision ka to, baati chod do, vision jiska bada ho, wo complain kari nahi sakta. Managing Stop. time is a problem, colleagues ke saath problem ho gaya, competition nahi kar sakte, confidence Stop. issue, work decision nahi le sakte, no, all this. Stop. Now, uh, how I qualify to train you? This is Vijay Mahadan, the chairman of basis where I work, he is known as the father of microfinance. He is my mentor. And if you read through his uh, appreciation for me, it, it came only four years back. I worked with him since 2008. And just now he had given, you can find out a solution. You can find out a way to solve a problem. Not many people can do this. Just then, mujhe ye mila tha ravi, I, I felt like I have won a Nobel Prize. Nobel Prize mujhe kese din milega na? I won't feel this happy. The day. And coming from such a person. Jisne, jisko pata hai, 2008 mein pata hai ki 2025 mein kya honne wala. Exactly same thing hoote ra. And everybody thinks ki ukhya jat, um, astrologer hai kya. But he knows what happens. No, us bande se hai mujhe ye appreciation. So he must have seen something. Usne jo kuch bhi kiya tha, waise hi karke maine wo uh, kiya. And he was surprised. Ki ek jaga jahan pe ladki kiya. Ladke tak nahi jate. I went there, stayed in the jungle for four years. And it was a food scarce pocket of Madhya Pradesh, Naksal area, you will hear in the Chhattisgarh. And um, I made that area food sufficient. Not only that, or we made, or the slide hai, usme aap dekhega ki kya, tuha bhi kiya. So it came from that person. So I'm very proud. And I'm the same person who was, who couldn't do for 20 years, who couldn't do anything in the job when I had. So, and this is my mentor who told me that you can do good things. This was in the COVID time. He is a very young person. I am a young person. But when he saw what I was writing, he was watching that. And he said, he was very high level ki coaching kar sakte ho, mentoring kar sakte ho, why not do this? You will do a service to people. Right. So, so I am very indebted to him. Very obvious. Right. 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 This is his mentor. 
and uh, I have uh, taken his course and this is the first level I have qualified. So he was interviewing. And this is the advisor of Robert Kiyosaki. He's dead poor. This is the mentor of that mentor. So he is my grand mentor. So I'm learning from him. And he said, he, uh, do you teach courage to your people? So mere, uh, mere scheme mein tab tab courage nahi tha. So he said, leadership is all about courage. So teach that. Unhone bola. And this is, this is the slide he framed when he was talking to me. So, uh, so I learned this. So this is why I say that I qualify to teach you. And this is the certification I got. So, wow. so, so what do we work towards? Goal hai aapka, purpose hai aapka, freedom chahiye aapko, and family ke liye karna hai. Then, if you have all this in mind, then definitely this, this kind of training is for you. Now, my values are tied edge. What are the values? Why value? Value because this is how my life is guided. This is the purpose compass, I can see. Tide edge is tranquility, I is inclusion, D is dignity, A is abundance, which is obviously wealth, L is learning and J is joy. So these are the six values I have. And for this and this package, I have developed a system which I call as leadership growth blueprint. And the tool is resourceful influence. The strategies are fourfold. Difference, resilience, influence and promise. You can call them as drift. And AHAP method, which is attitude, habit, action and perception. And this whole package is leadership growth blueprint. Why I have this blueprint is, anyways, you have to establish your uniqueness. You already are unique, but do you know you are unique? So establish that first. You have to know what So you have to first get convinced about your uniqueness that difference you need to establish and you have whatever uniqueness you have got, you have to prove that over and over and over again. That is what resilience will be. That is when people will get to know ki tum mein kya hai. And with that, you will influence people and you will achieve prominence or significance whatever. And the moment you achieve significance, us level pe bohut sare log waise hi honge of your level. So, this whole khel fir se wo difference, resilience, influence and prominence se shuru hota hai. So, this game goes on and on and on. Or how would you difference, differentiate yourself easily after that is ahab mein. Aapka attitude, habit, action and perception kya hai? The better your mindset is, your emotional intelligence is, the better person you will be, you are, and you will uh, say win over all the competition that you have. And for resourceful influencing, I have a 10P framework. Thus, P may aapko sikhati hu. With that, you can easily focus on with whatever you do, whatever you love to do. So, uh, the three secrets that I teach is unbeatable USP. That differentiates you. Expertise because you build your resilience and expertise. you establish your resilience and in sameness. The third thing that I say is it is a milajula thing of your expertise, uniqueness, uh, everything plus a connectedness. Up kisike sa jagra karke ya fir conflict mentality rakke, you will not no. uh, survive no. as a leader. Correct. Aap hamesa hi manager rai jau ke fir. A manager is a very efficient person without heart. A leader is a person with a heart. Wo kisi ka bhi negative point bhi hota hai to usi ko positive bana ke aage leke chala ga. So are you that person? 
अगर आप वो पर्सन हो तो आपको वो ही हरा नहीं सकता दैट कनेक्टेडनेस यू नीड टू सर एंड दीज आर द्री सीक्रेट दैट आई टेक यू और जो भी ये नाइनटी परसेंट मेरे साथ रहेंगे आई विल हैव वन टू वन सेशन बिकॉज आई नो एवरीबडी इज वेरी डिफरेंट यहाँ पे पचास लोग भी है इस कमरे में एंड एवरीबडी हैज द सेम काइंड ऑफ प्रॉब्लम सेम गेल कुछ भी है स्टिल यू पीपल आर वेरी डिफरेंट so right. whoever stays there will get a one to one session for free for one okay. hour okay okay and these strategies i as as i call it is uniqueness resilience how to influence people and connect these are the four strategies and i promise you a tenfold 10x personality version change and the first The moment you decide that there is a solution to your problem, अभी तक तो सोचा ही नहीं था कि there is a solution to your problem. The moment you decide that there is a solution to this, your personality becomes a protagonist. And here a personality makeover happens. First stage. And here you decide who you want to be. ये पहला decision. The second is your personal abilities कुछ भी है. बिकॉज द मोमेंट आई से तुम ये बन सकते हो यू आर नॉट गोइंग टू बिलीव मी तो अभी आपके जो एबिलिटीज है उसी को लेटोरी क्या तो देश दैट यू विल ऑन गो इट विल गिव यू एटलीस्ट फाइव स्ट्रेंथ फाइव स्ट्रेंथ देगा तो फाइव वीकनेस भी देगा सो अनलेस दो वीकनेसेस एग्जिस्ट यू कैन नॉट हैव दो स्ट्रेंथ so so I call those weaknesses as altered strengths so five plus five हो गया. two skill हर किसी के पास मैंने अब तक देखा है so twelve हो गया and one aptitude उस तो आपको अच्छा लगता होगा so it becomes थर्टी so if we form a story we take one element from each category so four categories we have taken थर्टीन c फोर Which means thirteen into twelve into eleven into ten. वो seventeen thousand stories होते हैं. How many do you know? अगर आपको सौ भी पता है, सौ पता होगा नहीं. सौ जिस दिन पता होगा तो उस दिन आप stuck नहीं रहो. You will be a thought magician. So at least hundred story we can work together. वैसे मेरे पास framework है, उसमें दो लाख आपके competency story बन सकते हैं. so uh, the moment you put feed all those strengths weaknesses and everything it creates two lakh stories for you stories kya wo headline de denge and you can remember abhi 2 lakh to aapko instances immediately yaad nahi aayenge but over a period of time if you are becoming very observant about your day to aapko har ek moment mein ek story dikhega win win story dikhega That if you can start uh, jotting down, तो आपको दो लाख स्टोरी क्या तो चार लाख पंद्रह लाख भी स्टोरी कम पड़े सो दैट यू बिकम एट द सेकेंड स्टेज थर्ड स्टेज प्रोडक्टिविटी ऑफकोर्स रिसोर्सफुलनेस यू विल लर्न हियर एंड वी कॉल यू एज ए फाइव इयर फोर्थ इज पंक्चुअलिटी ऑफकोर्स टाइम एफिशियंसी वी कॉल यू एज ए क्रोसेडर Fifth is team building. Usko power bond nahi bol rahe hain. You will be a cruising captain. Of course, you will know how to build a team, how to manage conflict, how to manage deal with ambiguity. Aapka boss kuch bolta hai, boss ka boss kuch bolta hai, aapka colleague kuch bolta hai. How to synchronize and take everybody to the same page. Next is decision making and Pareto formula. Sikhenge prioritization. मैं अगर आपको बोलूं कि जस्ट फोकस ऑन वन टास्क के डे आप बोलोगे कि दिन में में मेरे टू डू लिस्ट ही पचालीस काम है हाउ कैन यू से कि वन काम मैं ही रखूंगी सो दैट रिक्वायर्स ए डीप वर्क डायडमो आप अब बहुत गहराई में नहीं जाओगे आपके काम को एनालाइज करके देन यू कैन नॉट अप्लाई पॉलिटो फॉर्मूला जिसमें ट्वेंटी काम आपको एटी रिजल्ट देता है यू कैनोट सिंपली फाइंड आउट एंड हाउ डू यू डू दैट Is decision making. कौन सा काम करना है और कौन सा काम छोड़ना है दैट रिक्वायर्स लॉट ऑफ इनर वर्क 
That is what I call as deep work dynamic. Next is pattern of response. This is simply about communication. And communication has three aspects, style, skill, strategy. Uh, uh, when I say communication, you think of English. It is not about English. Suppose I, I uh, ask you to tell in Hindi. Aap Hindi mein bolo, jo bhi aapko bolna. You still cannot say. Kyu? Masala hi nahi hai sir andar. Masala hi nahi hai. Bolne ko kuch nahi hai to English jane se bhi kya bolo ke? Correct. So you know, you need to know ki what to say. Which audience to say? Aapke paas bohat sari audiences aate hai. So here we will learn uh, a template jis mein aap communicate karo. So first you have to learn and practice with that template. Over a period of time, you learn how to speak, communicate without those templates as well. So here we call you as a storyteller. Next is voice. This is about mindfulness, a half method. And I we call you as a signing signature. Mindfulness is pause. When there is a problem, pause for a moment, you will get your solution. But that is a discipline in itself. So it requires some time. And the ultimate is passion, where you will mentor, collaborate, communicate properly, and you become a game changer. So, the, and ultimately you become a unicorn, a high value individual achieving significance. So this is the journey that you will go through. And who I am? I am a mathematics postgraduate with 25 plus years of experience. But whatever I have done in my life so far is non-mathematical. And always I have chosen unpublished jobs. Kahi pe published job hua hai, usi ko apply kiya nahi. I always proven myself before entering the job. USP is resourcefulness. And my mantra is start small. Or kaam karte rao. So you ultimately will have a Warren Buffett effect. Compounding ho jayega ho. But you have to be very consistent and building small all the time. 1% develop improvement over a previous day. And this is my family. And this is my extended family. And key patterns in my life, single mother of two children, huge responsibility during this time. Professional life got affected because of personal problem uh, during this time. Past worker, saved budget, but was not proving skill or strategy. That has been my third pattern. Turning point happened when I attended a HR workshop meant for HR professional and I was never HR trained. So what happened in that workshop? I was required to present a HR policy of my organization. And that time, I was working for a very small organization which didn't have any HR policy. And there were participants of very huge organizations also, which had <laughs> which had HR policy already drafted. So then I drafted HR policy then and there and presented. So all other participants, they, they were presenting only the HR policies which are already drafted. Now what I presented was, I drafted and presented. So that that is when I was automatically selected. Uh, recruited for the biggest organization where Vijay Mahajan Saab was working. So, so got selected with that organization after one and a half years. Tabhi mere dimaag mein aaya nahi tha. Mere dimaag mein tabhi tak wo aaya nahi tha. Ravi, jo mene bola tha na ki wo tipping point pohja nahi tha uh, because I didn't have that conversation with my right. husband till that time. So right. after one and a half years, actually, I applied in that organization and people remembered me. Right. So, safety is my pattern. Kya change ho gaya, Ajahnaksi? I was that negative person before joining this organization. And the day I joined this organization, I was given challenging task. Right? So, I knew that I have a dream bigger than whatever designation I was on. And in that, I was given the task of enumerating 45 lakh women in two months time. 45 lakhs in 29 districts. How did I do? 
I actually sourced 12,000 volunteers, trained them, and put in 65 camps in across every district had 65 camps in different areas. That is how we completed, completed the task of enumerating 45 lakh women in Rajasthan. Rajasthan, I, I was never been. That was my first time. And everybody was asking, Tumko kaise khana mil jata hai jan, um, kisi ki gaon mein jati ho hai. Sab ne dekha hai juri. The moment I reached, kabhi mujhe mile nahi, wo la ke bada asa glass de diya chanj, and then roti boti le aai. And uh, everybody say ke koi kuch magic karti ho gaya, tawa chera de ke kise khana mil jata. So I said, maybe I am vibing at it. No, mujhe wo confidence hai, ki I am not go hungry anywhere. Ever, ever. So, so maybe that was the power with it. Mujhe pata nahi tha, but that is what I discovered when people told me. It, aise kaise ho jata hai? The second I was in Meghalaya, um, this was in 2008 to 10, when there was uh, the first time uh, the CSC program was getting implemented. And in all the seven districts, we I had to establish 239 common services center. Business plan unko dena tha. Main ghar ghar ghoom ke lo, ye youth ko bula ke training dethi thi. And business plan was the most challenging thing. Unko paisa kaise generate. To ye set up kiya nearby the banks or government department. So that they can get some typing work say or some thing. Some utility bill payment karke. And now, now it is this one CSA in Mithala requires 3 to 4 lakh deposit. Us time mein ghar se bula ke diya. So, I created livelihoods. Abhi bhi. Mera naam koi nahi le to kya hua. But I was instrumental in figuring that. And another kaam bhi kiya tha. Ki Meghala mein jo uber khawad hai na. Ti irregular tere. Waha pe aapka broadband nahi kaam karta. So, CSC required a broad uh, a connection. Network connection. Nahi to data kaise upload ka. Because CSC is that. Whatever services you come to the capital city. You will get it your doorstep. For that, network, um, this connectivity is required. So, what was the alternative? To the telephone department, I told them to give data card and visa. They were surprised ki aapko, are you a technical person? No, technical person. Nahi. The requirement is that. That is how I find solution. If you have to do a requirement, you will find a solution. Right? So, this is the The moment you are utterly there is a requirement, you will find a solution. So, this uh, solution I am, uske baad to telephone department ke, jo bade -bade officers ke Delhi jab ke aate te, to bula de te ki, aajau, bolo, phir, aur kya to go. So, hey, abhi to aap dek lo. <laughs> abhi to humne solution to liya. Uh, this is the 1500 people I trained. And then, towards the last, after those uh, those things were installed, 239 CSEs were installed, I developed an ecotourism plan out there. Because Meghalaya is very beautiful. So, if people who have been educated and extra skilled, if they can do something, then ecotourism was the only alternative. So, ecotourism was done there. Today, everyone is uh, then I was transferred to Andhra Pradesh and Telangana where there was a crisis going on in microfinance also. So I learned the business analytics that time and I tracked whatever the payment collection was happening. Then I came to Bandhavar, uh, Tiger Reserve, or Google to So this is uh, Eastern Madhya Pradesh and where people were getting killed because it, it was a Tiger Reserve. And there was no food. Food was only for three months. So people were getting killed. So forest department ne humko bola tha ki give them an alternative livelihood solution. So I went there and this is what I was uh, teaching them. I gave them four alternatives. First was SRI, system of rice intensification. Second is integrated farming. Third is herbal uh, mustard cultivation. And fourth is herbal cultivation. And these were the illiterate ladies. Within four years of time, they became the 
members of the district governing board, which was under the collector. So, illiterate ladies. So, my dream was to report to these illiterate ladies as a CEO of the company, jo grassroot based organization. Tha. So, the collector used to be very happy with my dream. Yes, our dream, Ajke Din my comrade, I'm Mahatma Gandhi Jamane Otawa. So, these ladies won themselves 17 awards. One award was from CIL, and the award was, I'll tell you, they broke mustard production record of Madhya Pradesh. They, are, they, they formed a federation which had 36 lakhs of workers. These illiterate ladies have been in four years of food sufficiency. People say that 70 years ago, we have not gone to the country yet. But I could achieve that in four years. So what formula I adopted that I can give to anybody and everybody, one thing I know is that one dedicated person to handhold those people is required only. So that is why also I am teaching that if this mentality is you can have better technology, you can also operate from Delhi uh, to handhold them, you can do anything. But this is possible and ladies became leaders and they also won one award from the then Chief Minister of Gujarat, Mr. Narendra Modi. Tabthe. So this couldn't have been planned, na, Ravi. So I couldn't have planned ki Chief Minister se award di tenge, or wo Chief Minister aage ja ke Prime Minister banega. Main to nahi kar sakti thi. This was from Uber wala, right? How did right. I achieve that? Because I was doing small small things consistent, consolidating, that thereby empowering these people. And these people only achieve. I am not saying that prize is not going to be able to get it. And she won this CIA award of 1.5 lakh cash because she had a concept that Punji is Punji. She knows that the Gari, the vicious circle of poverty, can be escaped if we can form. Some amount of capital, right? Sangeeta, Sangeeta, how yes. many more slides you are having now? There were four hundred slides, Ravi. One, one, one. The point is, it is now nine six. Yeah. So I have to go down for a shop, which will close at nine thirty. Okay. So I have to get something. I already paid it. So ah. I have to just get the delivered. Nahi to saare no bajao band kar dega. Acha. So can we continue from this slide? Tomorrow later on, tomorrow evening. Okay, done. So hai. you just see the slide number. So, this is the 